Good morning. We are here with the key horses for Gulfstream Park and Pimlico. Pimlico already started uh, its car for today. And we are for Instagram. We are live on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook for Gulfstream and Pimlico. Let's go to race number two at Pimlico. Uh, 16 minutes is the time for the post time. This horse at midnight uh, was uh, fourth last time out. Is coming back with Jose Gregorio Torrealba, and I believe uh, this uh, filly, uh, daughter of Cantaros, is going to run very well today. So the number six in race two has uh, a key horse in race number two. In race number four, I like row the boat. The number seven has an with a good opportunity to take the victory. A horse that is going to take the, the chance of this uh, pace that is going to be extremely fast, and I believe row the boat is a key horse in, in race number four. In race number seven, let's go to race number seven, uh, in the number 12, the girl uh, from Ireland, uh, the long shot of the system, 24% to win, a uh, horse that won in a good uh, turf course. The, the turf course today at Pimlico is good. So for Graham Bochon, I believe the number 12 and also the 11 some B from Graham Bochon as well has a good opportunity, but don't leave out this long shot, the girl from Ireland. In race number nine, we have another key horse for today. She feels pretty. She is the top pick of a Connect, 52% to win. She is a superior horse. I believe she ran very well in the Breeder, uh, Breeders' Cup, Juvenile Phillips, and she is going to chase the speed today. She won easily in a good course at Goodwin by almost five lengths. So she feels pretty good with Johnny B aboard. It's a single for me. In race uh, number 10, you can use the number three. You almost had me, has a good opportunity to win, but don't leave out Carmelina. She was running uh, over a mile in the last two races. Is coming back to short distance. The six foreign is perfect for her. Carmelina is a danger today. And in race number 12, the other single is uh, Kings Barn, 40% to win. Uh, the enemy, the number five, is a slow horse. And typically, it's better for uh, horses that run at the lead. So I believe Kings Barn is going to deliver in race number 12. At Gorsham Park, let's talk about in race number two. I have uh, two horses here that are um, keys. Uh, Scali on the number four. The user is not too high, but this is the topic of a connect 44% to win, 7 to 2 in the money line. It's a must in this race. And the number seven, Muntalik, 22% to win. is the favorite of the morning line, but don't leave out the number four, Rapscali, on both our key horses here. In race number five, let's insist. We dominate the moment, 16% to win, one in the money line. The long shot of the system is the, the horse that has to be to at the distance. He's going to run very well today. In race number six, uh, I believe Chasing Silver is another key horse. A horse that's up 12% to win. is going back to that. She will improve a lot today. So this uh, Adio Charlie has a key horse. In race number seven, single for the big six, the speed of the man up front. A horse that went for one of the distance, the top just out of the race. He's a very good horse. He's improving every day uh, a little more. And in race number nine, another horse that is going to lead from the beginning every four years, the number one, the topic of a Edge. I believe he will win last race. Good luck today at Pimlico and Washington Park.